At a recent interview, David O extensively spoke about how he got involved in the music industry, looking at the lives of whiskey, the lives of the band, and a lot of other, and talked about how his father built him a world class studio where the band, whiskey, and others came to record their songs. I think uh, we need to listen to this in this particular video. For more updates like this, you can click the subscribe button below the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos. Already, he's starting his US tour soon and a lot of people are really excited to get the Timeless album and also to get the Timeless concert in US. The responses David is getting to his Timeless album is becoming huge at the end of the day. A recent statement he made about Bonner Boy is causing social media stir this time around. A lot of people are saying David needs to apologize to Bonner Boy for calling him New Cat and grouping him alongside Rema Mayoko Fireboy in the industry. Seeing the new cats coming up, you know, for like Burner Boy. Davido in the same interview talked about the next fives that is Rema, Buju, Ashake, Irasta, Ruga. That is what is trending right now on social media. A lot of people are sparking some reactions around this and saying that why would Davido not mention big names like uh, Victoria and others? We need to understand that yes, everybody is entitled to their own opinions. That is one thing we need to understand. Let's catch a glimpse. Next, next five. Yeah. I can see the next five yeah. next five because i don't want to you know leave people yeah. out i say rema you got the calm down record calm down mm -hmm. calm down i say rema i say buju i say ira star i say victoni who's rema buju ashake without a doubt ashake no he gone oh good he nice ira star ira star gruga the the the, the future afro beast is crazy because now it's different you know before we needed a whole studio mm -hmm. to record mm -hmm. now I, I, you can record on your phone mm -hmm. you can record on your phone and these boys are so good he went for that to say i already knew people like whiskey wandeko and the band before moving back fully to nigeria from us let's listen to him so i already kind of knew people in the industry i knew whiskey i knew wandeko i knew the band so my plan was shamba's about to go back and turn up and I knew I was good. I had the music, I had the music sense, everything. So I moved back to Nigeria fully. First time. Reactions as David O reveals how Whiskey the band others used to come to his studio to record their songs. He built me the best studio mm -hmm. in Nigeria. I mean like everybody used to come whiskey the band so that is when i started like catching a glimpse of that interview is an interesting one he also went further to reveal the word of his blue passport and it's not chicken feed that is one thing you need to understand about the whole thing and he talked about his blue passport that is american passport worth more than a million dollars to him that blue passport is worth more than a million dollars so even parts of like my band members they're getting like difficulties into like getting the paper because just because of the, that passport do you understand obviously it's kind of easier for me because of the blue pass so that's like an example of how it kind of has been easy for me how what can you tell out of this i want you to put that in the comment section because a lot of people are really responding to our story so far you can go and check us out on social media platforms facebook tiktok instagram and be a part of our daily conversation